Hi everyone, this is an update on my interferon treatments, uh, April 29, 2010. I've made it through my week 12. I took my injection last Friday at 10 o'clock as usual in the evening. Uh, the injection went really well. It didn't hesitate, so maybe tomorrow it'll go okay with me too. This past week I've been experiencing some more sickness. Oh boy. It doesn't last long, but it seems in the evening I have been experiencing from like one to three hours of really, really bad sick, like a bad flu, aching, um, I kind of get real whiny feeling, um, but I take an ibuprofen 800 milligram, lay down, and it usually goes right away. So, you know, I'm, I'm not sure if that's going to progress or not. Let's hope not. But uh, it seems, though, this week I've been a lot more sicker than usual. Um, you know, mentally, I'm still positive. Um, I'm uh, hopeful. And I'm trying to be as happy as I can. I like to joke around, kid around with my wife, Tammy. I know it aggravates her, but it just kind of keeps my spirits up. Um, I have fallen just a little bit into some depression this week uh, nothing major I don't feel that I need any kind of depression medicines or anything but uh, the reason for this is due to the fact that my hair it, uh, it's it gets real dry although I use a lot of conditioning and stuff it gets real dry and it just breaks right off and uh, you know that's part of the side effect uh, it's like just like chemotherapy so right now my hair is uh, wet, I just got out of the shower, but um, it's getting thinner and thinner. And um, you know, like I was speaking to my cousin uh, yesterday here on Facebook, and she lives in Boston, Massachusetts, and she says, I'd rather you lose your hair than your life. And you know, that is that is a good way of looking at it. I know I've heard that before, but uh, I think it's an ego thing more than anything. You know, I don't want to lose my hair. <laughs> But, you know, there's nothing I can do about that. I have been uh, needing to uh, limit my activities. I've uh, still gone out and tried to do some yard work and different things. But uh, I'm not able to just, I'm not able to take it. It's uh, really, really difficult on me. Um, so I just got to kind of take it easy and just do a little bit at a time. Um, pace myself as my doctor told me to. Speaking of, I go back up this coming Monday. I get to go up uh, to see Dr. Lena Berry at the Ohio State University, Dones Hall. She's going to be um, doing some more blood work, and that is going to be one of the most exciting ones for me. Because um, she believes that I'm going to be in remission. Uh, my viral count should be clear down to zero. So that gives me a lot of hope. Um, even though it'll be down to zero, hopefully, uh, I will still continue on the 48-week treatment. Uh, there's no way I can stop because it could uh, come back on me. So, uh, New Year's Eve is on a Friday this year, if uh, you don't know, and that's the uh, last injection night for me. I give myself my last injection on New Year's Eve, and it's all over with. Um, Still got a long road ahead of me. I'm still hopeful, happy, and I appreciate all the support. Uh, I have had some people come up and tell me that uh, their loved ones have uh, hepatitis C that they had contracted in their past um, and had some questions for me. Uh, that makes me feel good. I, I encourage anyone out there to ask me anything you want. This is basically why I'm doing the video documentaries here on Facebook, and I'm planning on uploading them on YouTube as well. I think uh, it would get more publicity, uh, reach out to others who are afraid, and may have some questions. Um, again, uh, I've, I've had much worse things happen to me in my life, so the treatments aren't the worst of ever, you know. It's, um, it's not fun, but... Hey, it's tolerable so far. That's all I can tell you. You know, uh, to keep watching. Uh, you'll see the progress with me, and you can make up your own decisions, what you would like to do with your life. 
anyway everyone out there say no to drugs and alcohol uh, what does they say up with the hope and down with the dope <laughs> take care of your bodies love yourself I love you everyone have a great weekend and hopefully I'm gonna feel good enough to give you my uh, progress next Thursday every Thursday I put a video up so everyone have a great weekend and God bless Hope to talk to you soon. Mwah.